Today I'm going to talk about why superchargers are the way to go for power in your car. If you're the type of person who thinks it's better to burn out than fade away, well listen to this video about superchargers. Chargers and superchargers both compressed air, but they do it differently. As you can see on the turbocharger, it uses exhaust gas to spin a turbine, which then compresses air, sends it through a cooler, and then into the intake manifold to boost the engine. Where superchargers uses a belt that runs off the engine to spin and then compress air and throw it inside the engine. It's more direct. Now I like superchargers for power, and I know people are saying, Scotty, but most of the modern cars come with turbochargers, why? Well in the United States that's mainly because of federal law. There's so much pressure on the manufacturers to make cars with better gas mileage, and on a dynamometer, a turbocharged car is going to get better fuel ratings, so of course that's what they're going to build. But when it comes to adding power to your car, I like superchargers for a lot of reasons. They cost less to install, they're easier to install, they're less complex, and my favorite reason is they have more fast direct power. You step on the gas, they go, there's no lag, it's run off the belt, it's spinning all the time, it doesn't have to wait for the turbo to spool up with exhaust gas to get going really fast. And anyway, I'm old fashioned, to me, simpler is better, and a supercharger is simpler. Don't have to uh, infringe on the exhaust system as much. Typically a supercharger is easier to install, um, also your control of the boost, if you're on the throttle you have boost, if you're off the throttle you don't have boost. And they're fairly, fairly simple to install, uh, they're all belt driven or most of them are belt driven. There's many many different aftermarket uh, applications to where you could basically put a supercharger on just darn near anything. Now you can supercharge a lot more things in cars and trucks, check this out. From a UTV, ATV, uh, all the way down to a personal watercraft. You can do Jeeps, you can even do these carts if you want. As you can see here, it's all belt driven, just bolt on. And if you want to talk about power, the engine would be 500 horsepower, but with the supercharger on it, puts out 1200 horsepower. An engine is basically an air pump, and what you're doing is you're increasing uh, the amount of air that the engine can pump with a supercharger. And of course if you want it done right, you need the pros to do the final tuning for it on a dyno. Here we have a Mustang dyno, this is what we utilize to uh, tune the vehicles that we work on here. Now say you want to supercharge one of your cars, there's nothing that beats a pro with years of experience to help you out. Usually uh, when we have somebody come in here, uh, my main thing is to talk to them about what their power goals are and what the setup is and I try to sell them a supercharger that down the road will fit any needs they might have because you might have somebody come in here that you know they only want to make 600 horsepower right then but then they're like well I might do a motor later on so we kind of try I I don't like spending people's money twice. As the last thing you want to do is put a gigantic supercharger on your car and find out it's going to blow your engine because it can't take it. These pros know what they're talking about. Usually like the two main kits that I, I talk to people about is either Pro Chargers or the Whipples. We can even do Magnuson Superchargers and you have different kinds too from you know your side mount to your top mount superchargers so there's a bunch of different options on them. So they've been doing this stuff for years. They know which ones are good, which ones are bad, and which ones are kind of in between. Now where do these things come from? You know, they're all United States made superchargers. Uh, Two of these companies are from California, uh, Pro Chargers from Kansas, um, Vortex from California, so they're all American made stuff. And these guys are just a phone call away. They're willing to talk and explain all kinds of stuff, how the systems work, what it costs. So if you're thinking about putting some serious power into your car, you might think about supercharging it. And remember, if you've got any questions, just visit the Scotty Kilmer channel. So if you never want to miss another one of my new car repair videos, remember to ring that bell.